Our goal is your satisfaction. Let us show you the way. Can I get my holding deposit back if I change my mind? If you take a holding deposit and then do not take the property off the market or decide to rent it to someone else following acceptable checks, the holding deposit should be returned to the prospective tenant in full. Can a landlord pull out after holding deposit? If you pull out, the landlord agent can claim the holding deposit as forfeit. In this scenario, the tenant doesn't get the deposit back. It goes to the landlord or agent to cover them against any loss of time and money. The 2nd of September 2019. Do I get my holding deposit back if I fail credit check? For example, you should still get your holding deposit back if you fail a credit check, provided you told the truth about your situation. The landlord must write to you within 7 days to explain why they are keeping the holding deposit. If they don't, they must return the holding deposit in full. The 23rd of September 2021. What happens after you pay a holding deposit? Once the holding deposit has been paid, the team will then carry out formal tenant references. If the tenant passes referencing, they can then move on to signing their tenancy agreement and organizing a move-in date. If, however, they unfortunately fail, this is where the holding deposit comes into play. Does a holding deposit go towards deposit? The money is usually put towards the other move-in costs, namely, any rent paid in advance and the tenancy deposit. So in practice, tenants don't actually get the holding deposit returned. Rather, the value is simply taken off the amount they need to pay for the other move-in monies. The 2nd of September 2019. Take our lead. Let's help you make your mark.